I'm gonna tell you two things that you have to do if you really wanna get that September back to school, fresh reset feeling. Yeah, this is for adults who are no longer in school. And also the one thing you want to avoid at all costs, okay? First off, can we just talk about why that feeling is so magical? It's like the feeling of a clean slate. You're not carrying over any from the past and anything is possible. There's also all of this unpredictability because you don't actually know what it's gonna be like, but you've decided to go all in and there's the possibility of reinventing yourself like there's just so much freedom in that feeling the thing is that feeling as adults we don't typically get that blank clean fresh slate and there's no time in our life where suddenly it's like okay reset you're gonna suddenly get new goals new timelines new people new experiences all at once with a whole bunch of other people getting the same newness as an adult it's messier there's way more uncertainty and often the stakes have changed. As an adult, sometimes it's easier to just let time go on and not notice that time is going on. I've seen so many people who have been wanting to make a change or make some sort of a leap or something and they've been putting it off until they get the confidence or the time is right or until there's a little bit less uncertainty because they don't want to fear rejection. I've seen people suddenly realize that they're kind of emotionally checked out from their own life. The magic of that back to school feeling is in part tied to the vulnerability of jumping into the unknown, but also it's part tied into the possibility of jumping into the unknown. The two things you need to get that back to school feeling, number one, you need to jump into some new things. And new in the sense that you're like, eh, I don't really know how to do this, how I fit or what's going on, like that, that level of new, okay? It's not like trying to do something harder or do more of something. It's new. The second thing is committing to an outcome that you really want. Like the stakes are high enough that you'd be disappointed not to get it. You're gonna need to imagine this. Like what, what does it look like? Who is this version of yourself that you really wanna become? Some of you might be going, well, is that kind of like a goal? Sure, maybe, but I didn't wanna use that word because some of you suddenly go into HR business mode, pass, fail when I say that and I don't want you to go down that road. But just to be clear, those two things, if they don't result in you changing some routines and crossing paths and engaging with new people, you're doing it wrong. It's gotta require some inconvenience to be blunt and some discomfort of the new in figuring it out. That's inherent in growth. And the thing to steer clear of is the perfectionist fantasy. Think of it this way, when I was in school, every September I'd be like, this year I'm gonna be perfect and I'm gonna do all of my homework every night. In fact, I'm gonna get a jump start on every single assignment. And like, really, let's be honest, that's completely delusional to think I was gonna go from maybe a big procrastinator to suddenly I'm ahead on every single thing. No, and it was this idea of like, if it's not all perfect, it's not worth it. So be really careful if in your head you're starting to imagine some sort of perfectionist scenario it's not about that it's more about kicking in to your gut instinct and your desires of how you want to show up in the world and those sounds like big words but it's kind of like what reinvention is all about right and that's what the september feeling gives us the possibility of if you're drawing a blank for what you want just look in the copy i just threw in a bunch of ideas that can at least get you thinking and if you really want the guarantee that in the next six months you are gonna have that shiny new feeling and you're gonna do new stuff, check out Kickstartology Coaching. We're starting a new cohort in September and there you're gonna have the accountability, you're gonna have a program to help you learn how to inspire yourself and get going, get out of that comfort zone. On top of it all, it's really fun. So if that's interesting, find the link, book a call with me. We're gonna have a conversation. You're gonna find out everything you need to know to see if it's the right fit for now. Now go out there and take advantage of that shiny, fresh new September feeling and do stuff. I almost forgot I wanted to tell you, in the coaching program, you get this shiny, pretty workbook. Like, how good is that in terms of getting the back to school feeling, right?